Hi, thank you for joining me again. I'm Jose Saldana. This is my daily devotion. Today, Leviticus chapter 20 and verse 26. The Lord speaks and he says, And ye shall be holy unto me, for I, the Lord, am holy, and have severed you from other people, that you should be mine. The word severed is a very strong word. It's not like he's simply saying, I have separated you from other people so that you can be mine, or I divided you from other people so that you can be mine. Severed means to cut off, to chop off, to sunder, to amputate, to completely separate sharply as if with a knife. It is a very strong word. It puts a sharp division between his people and other people. It's very closely related to circumcision that God instructed Abraham to implement. The cutting away of the flesh was a bloody mess, but it was symbolic. Uh, uh, it was a symbolic representation of the severity of the severing. When baptism in Jesus' name replaced circumcision, it kept that very same sharp division. We are cut off from the world. We are cut off from our past. We're cut off from our sin, cut off from our old mindset, cut off from our old attitudes, cut off from our old actions, our old deeds. I've been cut off from my old guilt, cut off from my old shame. Those things are now no longer a part of me. They have no part in me because of we have been severed or separated from those things. Um, the bonds of sin have been broken and been cut off. We are severed from old things, and now he makes all things new. This is how we can walk in newness of life, because the old man, the old uh, corruptible, the old wrong, the old evil, the old darkness has been cut off and cut away from us, and now we can walk in newness of life. The word holy itself means to be set apart. It means to be separate, to be totally or completely other. So when God says, I, the Lord, am holy, I am set apart. I am separate. I am something that nothing else is. We ought to be identified as completely other, different. There should be something noticeably different about us, about our speech. It should be other. Our attitudes should be completely other. Our appetites should be completely other. The way that we move and walk and talk and live in this world, we've been completely severed, not only from other people in this world and its mindset, but from our old past. We've been severed and cut off and made new. So let's keep it that way.